down here in Detroit with team number 4362, the Gems coming out of Michigan here. These are your Michigan State Championship winners, uh, also winning districts as well, too. Absolutely phenomenal team. We're going to check out more about the robot on Behind the Bumper. So I have Gunner, Ethan, and Kevin, and we're going to start out here uh, with your uh, intake that you have for your cargo. So let's talk about that a little bit. So basically how our stage one cargo intake works is uh, so it is able to extend and retract based on how our lift works. So this is able to extend out, which allows us to reach in and grab from the depot. And this will stay retracted until our lift goes up and it'll obviously retract. It does this by using uh, two pneumatics on each side and a chain to keep it in the same like set point so it doesn't overextend. keep rolling on here uh, we have a really neat elevator and then some cool software we're going to show up as well so let's talk about more about that kevin yeah so for our lift it is very similar to the lift we had last year in 2018 uh this year we took it and we designed it this really similar and then we upgraded it essentially uh so it uses it's a three cascading lift and we have constant force springs that effectively neutralize the weight. So all of the, our lift motors, the only thing they do is localize the lift and locate it so they're not lifting any weight. And the lift carries our carriage, which has our hash manipulator and our cargo intake. Let's wrap up here. We're going to hop back here in the back of the robot and talk about some of the software. And then you can mention about the linear slide you have as well, too. So let's grab the controls and start talking about what's going on uh, on this awesome bot. We have fully automated pickup and placement for hatch panels. That will control our steering and our velocity, so you can drive full speed at the wall. And it won't let you slam into it. Instead, it will slow down, grab a panel, and back up instantly. Uh, on top of that, we have a linear slide on the front of the robot that moves laterally to pick up panels. That's pretty cool. If you want to turn over there and see Kevin, he can show you the target moving left and right. That thing's really fun in the pits because it will follow safety captains and the reflective tape on their uh, vests. Yeah. Uh, another cool thing we have software-wise is our automatic transmission. We geared for 10 feet per second low gear and 20 feet per second high gear, which sounds like a really weird transmission because it is. And uh, we made that automatic, and that just lets Kevin go at a reasonable speed all the time until he really needs to accelerate more. And then he can get up there into the 10, 20 feet per second. Well, Jen's really cool robot. Can't wait to see how it pans out. Good luck to you the rest of the competition season. We need your help to keep fun loud, live, and independent. Help us by visiting our Patreon to pledge your support at patreon.com forward slash first updates now. You can also support fun live on Twitch for a few bucks a month or by linking your Prime account for free and clicking subscribe. Thank you to all of our co-executive producers keeping fun loud, live, and independent.